We did not have public transport. We had some extremely chaotic bus system, indiv almost individually owned buses, racing like crazy. They would stop uh, blocking the three lanes of road so that the buses behind would not overtake them. They would dump people in the middle of the street. There were many accidents, buses even going out of the street into the sidewalk and killing people. So instead of doing this huge investment in, in elevated highways, we decided we're going to move by public transport. It was a huge battle. Huge battle because the buses, the, the public buses in, 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 in Bogota were in the hands of a mafia. So it's a multi-billion dollar business. And then comes Peñalosa and said, forget it, I'm going to take away the biggest chunk of your business. This is going to be now a system managed by, by the local authorities. So if they were a very powerful political group which could also bring the city to a halt with a strike. <laughs> and we were going to substitute them totally by the new system. So it was a big challenge, a bit of carrot and a bit of stick. We said, we want you to become and be part of the system, to, for the traditional bus operators to be the shareholders in the new system. And in fact, there are some of those previous owners that comply with certain uh, rules and regulations and, and very tough ones, they can be part of this system. And that was intelligent to, to, to have them on board. So we structured a bus system which we copied from the city of Curitiba in Brazil, and we improved it a little bit. Today's perhaps the best bus system in the world. We call it Transmilenio. Transmilenio really shows a lot of what Peñalosa wanted to do, because Transmilenio is the public transportation system, and it changes the city around it. So it makes public space for pedestrians around it, which is the main goal of, of uh, Peñalosa's uh, city model. Uh, and it has become like our, how do you say that, emblem, our emblem, our, our we, we identify Bogota through Transmilenio right now. Clearly, you have to take into consideration these marketing issues. It's not just a matter of engineering. Public transport is not just a matter of engineering. We needed to make our bus system sexy. So one very important...